Hey, Clark Milan here, Affiliate Star and I welcome. It's going to be a short video on, on the graphic user interface for Google Photos. So in the other videos I showed you, um, showed you how to get into it. There's two ways you can go through the drop down there or you can go through Google Drive. Okay, so when you get to Google Photos, you're going to see that it's opened up. There's a top nav bar up here. And that's area number one to think of. So here, this will tell you which part of Google Photos you're in. I'm in Photos. There's a search box here, which you can use to search for photos in your, um, in your, in your, in Google Photos. When you go to the search box, it's going to default to four categories. It'll aggregate people, people, that is by faces, places, things, and types. So you can get creations, videos, Google Drive <clears throat> recently added. Then you have the plus sign here. This allows you to create albums with your photos. And then here you have access to your computer and you can upload pictures from your computer and interact with your, your files and your computer. Over here is in standard Google menu. Oops, sorry. Uh, it leads you to your products. Let's cancel this. And there you are. Now, on the left-hand side here is a sidebar. And if you click the sidebar opener, you'll see here there are <clears throat> different categories of features here. The assistant is a, a feature in which you can see what Google Photos has created of your photo library. And this is done without even any, your any action on your part. It, they just go ahead and create movies, stories out of stills, and so on. So you can sift through here and see what they've created for you. Photos puts you in touch with all of your photos. And as I told you before, you can go to use the search function to look for specific photos. Collections are albums that you have created and albums that have been created for you by Google Photos. Then you can get shared links. This allows you to take a link. If I want to get a link and share an album with someone, it'll give me that link and then I can send it to whomever I want. There's the trash, if you want to put stuff in the trash. Settings allows you to come in and organize the account the way you want to. So it, here you can select original uh, quality for your photos, in which case uh, you, it might be limited storage, or you can go with high quality, which is compressed, but still pretty decent. You can suggest new creations. So I've left these at the defaults, and it'll, it, it gives me what I want. I can group my faces. I can go get organized things through Google Drive, and I want to keep everything located by location. Here you can create the help feedback. And here you can see how to back up photos, how to change your sync settings, how to uh, delete and photos and videos, how you can edit and set, you know, all sorts of stuff here and how to learn how to use Google Photos. And then you have app downloads. So there it is. Now, you can do some very basic uh, editing. Uh, let me show you. So if you get a photo uh, and you, so you can share it, you can edit it. Now the editing <clears throat> comes in here and allows you to adjust exposure, adjust color temperature, and sharpness. Vignette is just a filter. Now if you're going to try to rotate, now you can see the sidebar up here, that allows you to do that. Over here, this will allow you to pick a filter that you may be interested in. And over here in cropping, this is where you can adjust and rotate your pictures in case your pictures come out. Now, if you do that, you want to click the check, the check button and save it, and you're done, and you can save it. So that's kind of a quick rundown on the editing. Here you can magnify, you can get information, uh, meta information about your photo. This is the trash if you want to send it to the trash, and there you are. So this is kind of a quick rundown of the user interface for Google Photos. And um, it'll get you started, and then you can just play with it. And that's it. This is Claude Blanc, Affiliate Starting On. Stay with it. Stay well. Talk soon.